Hello. Well, this isn't how this video was supposed to start. <laughs> it actually worked. Okay. Well, that's just a nice little conject. Anyway, today I realized something. I was sitting here thinking about the lion update and what I wanted to record. Uh, maybe go to Verhunga to, I don't know, hunt Verhunga once more before those lions come out. Whoa. That's a big red deer. Uh, and then I realized... I basically have until that lion update comes out to get a diamond with the 357. Now the reason I say that is, when the lion update comes out, I assume that brings the lung shot and spine shot changes with it, and that means either I get a diamond now, or I get a diamond with a much more restrictive either species list or shots list using this 357. Now a lot of you guys know that I have the goal of getting a diamond of every species here in Call of the Wild, but I actually set the goal of getting a diamond with every weapon first. So I kind of want to get this gun off the list because it's going to be really annoying if we have to go for double lung shots on way less species or more difficult shots on things like deer. That is not the red deer that we had to track from. Now, i got to be honest. I'll just throw this out here right now. I don't suspect there's going to be that much shooting with the 357. I, most of it's going to be with other guns because I'm still going to run around and hunt this map. I still really enjoy the species that are on it. I'm really only going to use the 357, maybe on an Axis Deer 2 to test and a Black Buck or two also, although I really don't know about the Black Buck. Uh, while I think they're going to be the most potentially common diamond to spawn, I really do not like my chances of getting very close. They're tough to call in and they're tough to stock up on, so we'll see how that goes if we do find one. I, I kind of hope it's an Axis Deer because they're way easier to call in in my opinion. But already gold number 2, 828 Red Deer. I like the way this is going, and I think that's a male black buck, isn't it? Oh, no way. <laughs> what the heck? I haven't had a level 5 black buck on my map. I've had it once, and it was with Gary on his stream. All right. Well, here we go, then. That'll be good. Oh, you look decent, actually. Ah, just a four. I wonder if he had a zone there. Because, as said, these black buck are so annoying. I can never call him in. And I've got a handgun, so I ain't taking a shot over 50 meters unless it just becomes the worst nightmare of my life, but wow, okay, that didn't take very long. Yes. We might do it. He must have a feed zone right there. I just heard a puma to my left somewhere. So that could definitely ruin this hunt, but I bet he has a feed zone out in the middle of that field, and we just have to really slowly Crawl our way in, and I think we got to hit him in the spine or neck, but that shouldn't be too incredibly difficult. It should be pretty straightforward. Where'd he go? I don't know if he's maybe stopped in there. He had to be going back. All right, he is back, but he knows we're here. I don't suspect we're going to get a better chance than this. If he goes broadside again, I'm going to go for it. I want to get in here, so we're kind of hidden. I don't trust myself to hit the neck with this gun. I just don't have the experience with it. Although, if he would if he would just put his neck a little more straight. Oh, man. Kind of glad he turned. I just want a more broadside, but man, he just knows we're here. And I don't want to go for that lumbar spine because I don't trust the gun enough because I've never done it. I literally haven't even gotten a practice shot yet. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> what the heck is that luck? I just... I haven't been on this map since... I don't even know when. When was I last here? I have no idea. Uh... Excuse me? How'd I do that? This is the strangest video I've ever done. Alright, I just tried to shoot an axis deer for can check and somehow I dropped the red deer. Anyway, uh, yeah. I don't know when I was last here. It's been a long time, and I decided to spawn down here, or start down here, because this is a decent lake for Black Buck, and there's a level 5 waiting for us, so that works out pretty well. How did I do this? Right in the brain. Could we talk about any more luck? Possibly. I mean, as far as I know, Mark and Sex, good. That's a level 5. Level fours can make diamonds, so we ought to be pretty set. I can't even I can't even believe what just happened. I I don't know. <laughs> uh, 
Wow. All right. So that'll be 357 actually off the list. I think I'm down to just the 3030. I, I had plans of all kinds of things I was going to talk about during this hunt because, as I said, I didn't suspect there was going to be a lot of 357 shoots, and I just kind of figured it would be hunting around and, you know, hoping and praying we'd see something similar to this guy right here, but he kind of showed up a little earlier than expected. So, just at this point, I think, kind of make sure nothing bad happened. He's a Diamond 962 with a 48 kilo. Middle neck shot, wow. Barely. Very barely with that 357, but that, that has it done. All right. I haven't even been recording for 10 minutes. Could not have asked for that to go any better. And that's my first level 5 black buck. I just did it with a 357. Anyway, uh, I think I'm down to, yeah, just the 30-30. I want to check because at this point, it's not like this has been a 20-minute video and we're just dying. So, probably just going to have a cut here until I kind of think through everything. Okay, so actually, I think... The 470 came out after I started focusing more on species, so that's what I still need, although that should actually be easier uh, when the double lung update comes out. I'm not 100% about the 223. I feel like I probably have one with it. I carry it so often. I mean, I have it on the beginner series for sure. Oh, musk deer. I have a musk deer with it. All right, yeah. So that's it. Just the 3030. I can put that away and never crack it back out. Now, I don't have, say... Uh, 270 Huntsman, 270 Stradivarius. I have it with the 270 Warden, but it's a 270 caliber. But anyway, yeah, I don't really want to worry about the 470 right now. I would, but as said, it'll actually be easier on the Buffalo and Bison when that double lung uh, change happens. And the 3030, I actually think the same about Whitetail and Blacktail over on Layton. I don't think it'll be an issue when that double lung update is officially out. So imagine that. I think we shot three animals. No, four, because they can check. And we're done. All right, that's probably the quickest Call of the Wild video I ever recorded. Anyway, I thank you guys for watching, and uh, I guess I'll see you next time. I don't even... That was insane. <laughs>